Uh, that was good. Nice work. Didn't miss Appreciate it. you for the high five there, Toddy. All right, shoppers in stores and online Friday deals at their favorite retailers. Joining us now to discuss what to look for and what to leave on the shelf from the stock swoosh. Melissa Arma, thanks for being here as always on Black Friday. So Good morning. Yes. let's go over the deals. I mean, because everybody wants their deals right now and tell us how we can get them and what deals we should get. Well, there's a lot of deals out there today. I think you really got to go online first to find out where the early doorbusters are. But make sure if you buy something at one of these doorbusters, sales look so good. And then you buy something, you're like, wait a minute, I don't really need that. Yeah. Right? <laughs> you know, you end up spending money that you don't really want to spend. But with the doorbusters, there is limited quantity for the electronics, TVs, computers. So if there is something that you want in one of those doorbuster sales that you see online, go there, go early because they have limited inventory. Okay, let's talk about specific items because I do feel like Black Friday tends to cater to electronics and TVs and things like that. Yes, actually, one of the best deals is Walmart has an Apple iPad for $250. That's a really good price. Yeah. And again, these are some of the things, if you need them even for yourself, it's called self-gifting, you can buy right now. Not just for presents, for presents for other people, but I for gifts I love the idea for of a self-gift. <laughs> the that, cyber guy just signed off on it. He gave me the thumbs up when you said $250. <laughs> He's in the background there. That's right. Early, then you so can yeah. also get a 70-inch TV for $750. Do you remember years ago, you couldn't get a TV like that a right. flat screen for less than like six grand yeah. seven hundred fifty dollars I mean that's worth going out and buying if you need one for your apartment or Absolutely. your home then they have a 65 inch smart Roku TV that's another good deal that's at Walmart that's for 398 again you can't beat these prices I mean some great prices Walmart has some really good sales going on today Apple watch also two hundred dollars at Target great price and it has a GPS you can hook it up and the Fitbit right now is a great price 120 at Target normally 150 mm. Huh. All right, so this is the good. There's also a lot of bad because yeah. people know that we're all trying to get these deals, and so then the scammers come out. What do we need to look out for? Well, what's really important for people is make sure if you're buying online that the site, if you're putting in your credit card information, is encrypted. So that's important. Also, make sure you're actually buying from the site. Now, how are you going to know? It says HTTP, and then it has the colon, and make sure it's williamsonoma.com or potterybarn.com. Make sure it has the actual retailer in there because if it doesn't, it could be a scammer. And the other big thing it's going on right now. This is new. Target has this. Make sure if you do buy online, pick up in store that you are actually going there and getting it and you're, you're, you're signing up for it and you have your information because there's a chance that you could get hacked and mm -hmm. then someone else goes, they pick up the merchandise and sell it. So if you're going to do that, I wouldn't wait like 24, 48 hours to go pick up the merchandise. If you're going to do it, go back today then and pick yeah. it up because someone else could hack. Go there, pick, pick up the up stuff and then thing. sell it. Oh, man. That, yeah, that's actually a good point. I never thought about that that's before. Right. Is it better to shop on Black Friday in stores or wait until Cyber Monday and shop online? Well, you know what? We, the Cyber Monday has only been for the last couple years. Mm -hmm. I think the, the jury's still out on that, where the best deals are. By far, if you really want to go out today and fight the crowds, I'd say have a good time if you're going to do it. Have fun. There's Christmas music in the stores because you're really going to get the best deal still by going in the store. Now, if you don't want to fight the crowds, wait till Cyber Monday because you're going to get the best deals online on Cyber Monday. But if you want to go out, have a good time. I say don't risk the farm, you know, and don't spend too much, but have fun when you're spending money today if you want to go out shopping. And, you know, in New York, it's fun. There's a lot of people out there, but you're going to get the deals today, really. So, so don't punch people. No. To that online. That's a note to you, Jersey Take away. Shinkus. Thanks, I'm Melissa. Very, I'm a very peaceful person. Thank you. That was very helpful. Thanks. Appreciate it. All right, time now 26 minutes.